Hi guys, welcome to the channel. Just a quick little video. Um, my car, I've got a Range Rover Vogue uh, L405 and it's starting to smell the air conditioning. So I've been to Halfords, which is a local uh, car hardware store, and I've got this STP Auto Aircon Cleaner. So it cost, I think it was £11.99. I think you can buy it a bit cheaper on Amazon. I'll see if you can tag the link on Amazon. But I just wanted to get it here to get it done because it stinks. It smells a bit um, moulder and apparently that's what it can be, bacteria build up because it's not been used for a while. So um, I'm going to give you a brief description and show you how how it works. First time for me using it so we're, we're going on the same journey but it says over time your air conditioning system can be contaminated by bacteria. This build up leads to bad odours and poor airflow. STP Aircon Cleaner can help clean and refresh your entire AC system. The simple lock and leave system eliminates bacteria and odour in your air conditioning system in just 10 minutes, leaving it clean and fresh. So that's their little picture. So apparently what you have to do is you have to set all your air conditioning to recirculation so it's the air going round and round, uh, not bringing it in from the outside. Uh, turn it to full, uh, full power, open all your vents, and it says assure the passenger seat is pushed and tilted far forward as possible. But I don't know why it wants you to do that. I'm not going to do that. Um, they're all programmed into where everyone likes them, so we'll get it. So it comes in a can like this. Probably it says give it a good shake. Give it a good shake. And then the top, apparently what you do is you put it, I think it's two thirds back into the car, let me see. So it says, uh, ensure place can on the floor two thirds from front passenger seat so I'm going to put it um, I'm going to put it in the footwell I mean, I'll show you in the Range Rover it's quite big so I'm going to stick it on the floor there in front of these vents so it can blow around and I get glow but apparently what it does is um, it just sucks the whatever's in the can around cleans the inside of the vents blows it all around for 10 minutes so you've got to leave the car running for 10 minutes because anyone knows with the Range Rover you turn the car off everything goes off in it which is a bit crazy um, so I'm going to do that all you do is you press the lid down and it'll lock itself open so I'm going to set it all up now I'll show you so here we are in the car so we'll put the max air conditioning on so that does everything latch cir recirculation on so it does it automatically so I, can s I can smell it now coming through the bad odour and then I'll jump out, I'll jump into the back seat, one second. So, so here's the can, oh shall we put it on the seat, in fact I'm going to put it on the seat, it's a better place. So you can see there, put it on the seat, everything's on, everything's blowing, everything's open. Uh, we'll turn that on as well, I don't know what it does but we'll try. So you hold the can down, right. And then you just leave that for so we leave that for 10 minutes now and apparently it fills the car up. The windows are blacked out to that so I can't show you. Um, well, we'll just uh, give it a quick 10 minutes and then we can come back to it. Ooh. Can't see it, can't see it filling up the car yet. You can see the can going up. I don't know if you can see. There's the can. No, it's not in Manchester. We're in Manchester, England. Yeah, this is the car we've got. So it's a 15, 15 plate. Lovely car to drive. If you've said get him on, I'd recommend getting one. Um, the whole price as well. So this one's just the Vogue. We've got a standard Vogue, but it had that many accessories on it. It was like the Vogue SE. The only thing that it didn't have that the Vogue SE has is the cool steering wheel and I think the soft closed doors. The rest of it had. Um, it's got all the other features on it, so it's a good, good car, we've got a good deal. So, that's three ten minutes. Right guys, that's it, ten minutes is up. So we'll jump in the car now and see what it's smelling like. It's absolutely pissing it down. Lovely weather. And I'm in the UK, you know what I mean. Sunny rain, let this car go past and get drenched. Right, we'll jump back in. So the car's been running for ten minutes now. The can is... Well and truly empty, it stopped to lap stop quite soon actually. Okay. It smells a bit icy fresh, so it says open all the windows and air the car out. 
So yeah, open all doors and windows to ventilate the car. So it smells like ice, ice fresh. Very fresh. I'm sure I'm not supposed to be sat in here with it while it's ventilating, but it smells a lot better than it did. Does it smell fresh? Good. I bought, uh, I bought this just in case as well. A little uh, new car smell freshener. But yeah, that seems to have worked. This smells nice, nice and fresh. So, uh, so far so good. I can only, um, want, obviously once the car's turned off, leave it for a bit, I'm gonna come back to getting in later. I'll uh, check if the smell's gone. I assume it has because it smells lovely and fresh in here now. Brilliant. That's worked. Anyone who knows that mouldy smell, get rid of it. 10 minutes, it's gone. Uh, so well worth 12 quid. I think it was about £7.99, 8 quid on, um, on Amazon. So I'll double check that and if I can get the link, I'll stick the link on it. So uh, review of STP aircon cleaner, fresh scent. I like it, it worked. So as we go into the garage, I was thinking about going to the garage and getting the air conditioning all serviced because I think you can get it where the spray foam in it and all that kind of stuff. But that seems to have worked a treat. I'll say only time will tell. Windows back up. Right guys, thanks for watching. Subscribe to the channel if you like it and I get some more videos up. Take care guys.